Hello and welcome to English Story TV, the YouTube channel and podcast that is designed to help you improve your English. Today's episode is about the Stuxnet incident. The Stuxnet incident, a highly sophisticated cyber attack aimed at an Iranian nuclear facility, arguably marks a turning point in the annals of modern warfare. This unprecedented event not only underscored the vulnerabilities inherent in digital infrastructure, but also illustrated the profound implications of cyber warfare on international security dynamics. Stuxnet's complexity, its execution, and the subsequent ramifications offer a rich case study for advanced English learners at the C1 level, providing insights into both the technical and geopolitical landscapes of the 21st century. In the summer of 2010, cybersecurity experts uncovered a piece of malware that was unlike anything seen before. Dubbed Stuxnet, this computer worm was designed to specifically target the Supervisory Control and Data Acquisition, SCADA, systems used in industrial and infrastructure management. Its discovery sent shockwaves through the cybersecurity community and international relations revealing the existence of cyber weapons capable of causing physical destruction and signaling a new era in the domain of warfare. Stuxnet's primary target was the Natanz Uranium Enrichment Facility in Iran, where it sought to sabotage the nuclear enrichment process. By infecting the Programmable Logic Controllers, PLCs, that managed the centrifuges used to enrich uranium, Stuxnet was able to subtly alter their speeds, causing physical damage to the centrifuges while remaining undetected for a significant period. The intricacy of this operation was unprecedented. Stuxnet not only had to navigate a network of digital defenses, but also possessed the knowledge to manipulate industrial processes. This level of sophistication indicated that its development was likely backed by substantial resources, pointing to state-sponsored origins. The implications of Stuxnet extend far beyond the immediate physical damage it inflicted. From a geopolitical perspective, it demonstrated how cyber capabilities could be deployed to achieve strategic objectives, offering states a means to exert power and influence covertly and remotely. This capability has profound implications for international law and the norms governing state behavior, as traditional concepts of sovereignty and territorial integrity are challenged by the borderless nature of cyberspace. From a cybersecurity standpoint, Stuxnet underscored the importance of securing critical infrastructure against cyber threats. The fact that a malware could leap from digital to physical effects highlighted the interconnectedness of modern systems and the potential cascading consequences of cyber attacks. This incident spurred governments and industries worldwide to reassess and bolster their cybersecurity postures, leading to increased investment in cyber defense capabilities and the development of policies aimed at protecting critical infrastructure. Moreover, Stuxnet has catalyzed a broader discussion on the ethics of cyber warfare. The deployment of cyber weapons raises complex ethical questions about collateral damage, the civilian impact, and the escalation of conflicts in cyberspace. Unlike conventional weapons, cyber tools can proliferate rapidly and be repurposed by various actors, including malicious non-state entities. This unpredictability introduces a new layer of risk in international security, as the barriers to entry for engaging in cyber conflict are significantly lower compared to traditional warfare. In the years following Stuxnet, the world has witnessed an increase in state-sponsored cyber activities, with numerous countries developing their cyber military capabilities and engaging in cyber espionage, sabotage, and influence operations. This trend suggests that cyberspace will remain a key arena for international competition, with cyber attacks becoming an integral part of statecraft. For advanced English learners, the Stuxnet incident offers a multifaceted topic for exploration. It encompasses technical descriptions of malware and cybersecurity practices, 
as well as discussions on international relations, ethics, and the evolving nature of conflict. Delving into this subject not only enhances language proficiency through engagement with complex and specialized vocabulary, but also fosters critical thinking about the implications of technology on global security and governance. In conclusion, Stuxnet represents a watershed moment in the history of warfare, highlighting the growing importance of cyberspace as a domain of strategic competition. Its legacy is a world more attuned to the threats and opportunities posed by digital technologies, where the lines between peace and conflict, and between the physical and the digital, are increasingly blurred. For those studying English at an advanced level, the analysis of such a pivotal event provides a valuable opportunity to expand their linguistic skills while gaining insight into the challenges and dynamics of the modern world. Thank you for staying until the end. If you found this video interesting, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you next time.